Hi, I'm Dan from Windows Plus and today I'm going to run you through how the door turns up and how you should go about glazing it, putting the panels in and then finally getting it adjusted so it works properly. The tools you're going to need for the glazing, you're going to need a glazing mallet, uh, some sort of a chisel to get the glass in and uh, get it seated right. When it comes from the factory, this is how it's going to look. First of all, you're going to need to take the keys out from the top. Comes locked, you just unlock it. Just put them to one side, don't leave them in because you might hit the key and snap them. Glazing packings in here, just take them out. don't need them yet. Alright, we just take the beads out, just pop out, that easy. Try to remember which ones go where, so they all go back where they come from. Always glaze the top first. Start off with the bridging packers that you get with your door every time. Just locate where the hinges are and start. You put the packers either side like that. Just make sure that's sitting on. Nice and level. Just grab your glass. When you're dealing with toughened glass, always toughened glass in a, in a door. When you're putting it down, make sure you're not putting it down on anything hard with on the corners or anything like that, because it'll just pop and smash the glass straight away. Get it up over the handle, just drop it in. Easy as that. And you just start by levelling off the glass there. Get it nice and level on this side. That's good. Just get and then there's one at the top. And that just lifts the door up so it doesn't sag over time it keeps it nice and level so the weight of the glass is actually lifting the door and then you start by putting the small beads in first doesn't matter where you start just the small ones top of the bottom and then just locate them nice and then just wait for that click and that's it. And again, just for the bottom panel. Just 
Again with the bottom. Blazing packers again. Obviously when it comes from the factory, it comes with this blue protective film on. It just peels off, dead easy. Just take it all the way off. Sit it down nice. Just do the same process again, making sure that it's quite tight. So when you open the door, it doesn't just drop. One down here. Just like that. And then I'll just show you the small adjustments on the hinges. On the hinges you have a cover cap on the outside. What you're going to need to do is, if you need any small adjustments, take it in or out away from the lock side. So there's just a little grub screw there. Start undoing it. Put your little grub screw to one side, don't lose it. It's the same Allen key again, just a three mil. Take your cap off. Then you've got an Allen key bolt in there. You can just, just turn it left and right. It will take it away from the door jam or closer to the door jam, whichever you need to go. You'll just see it move as you move the door. And that's it, and then just Top or bottom, whatever needs adjusting, adjust it. That's pretty much it. Thank you.